Iraqi officials say a U.S. prosecutor is in Iraq to collect testimony in the murder investigation involving five Blackwater security guards. On Monday, U.S. prosecutors charged the men with 14 counts of manslaughter, 20 counts of attempted manslaughter, and one count of using a machine gun to commit a crime of violence. Relatives and loved ones are seeking their day in court. The guards apparently wanted to shut down an intersection in a crowded Merchant Square. Witnesses say the contractors opened fire unprovoked, leaving the square littered with bodies and blown out cars. The shooting by the largest U.S. security contractor in Iraq sparked international condemnation and launched congressional hearings. Outraged Iraqis have waited more than a year to see how the United States would respond. In the meantime, they revamped their country's security agreement with the United States, set to take effect in January. It makes American security firms operating within the war-torn country accountable under Iraqi law. Blackwater Worldwide says the guards thought they were fending off a car bomb attack. It says its guards were only doing what they could to protect themselves. A judge ordered the guards to report to a Washington courtroom on January 6th, where they are expected to plead not guilty. Lee Powell, The Associated Press.